Hello and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm Marielle. We are at Kuchi Pine Valley KOA in Vermont and we are at site 69. Walter is back in Las Vegas. It's actually a pretty decent site except it's not really a pull through. It, it's a pull through but This is the pull through. So it's a pull through, pull through. So I don't really consider this a pull through. Anyway, we are almost leveled left and right. I did have to add one pad, 50 amps, water in, water out. So it is a, it's a nice park. It's nice and clean. There are a lot of bugs flying around, but they're not biting me. So I'm gonna go spray right now they weren't here yesterday maybe because it rained all day yesterday Starlick is having trouble because there's so many trees here so I'm gonna try this location over here and see if that one works okay we're gonna go spray we are here at March Billings Rockefeller National Historic Park. It is in Vermont. Okay, this was Vermont's first national park. is named after George Perkins Marsh, one of the first global environmentalists, environmental thinkers for Frederick Billings as an early conservationist and for Billings' granddaughter, Mary French Rockefeller discover the park's beauty as we you reflect on its history Ooh. okay kind of really confusing here they want you to park down there at the billings farm museum which is the trek and then they want you to walk up this big old mountain hill very confusing Okay, we're going to make a trek up the hill so I can get my stamp. Cannot see the inside of the house. It's only done by tours. It's a nine o'clock tour and a three o'clock tour. It's 320. We missed the tour and they are completely booked. But we can go outside. So this is the house itself. We are in New Hampshire. There's one national park here. It is the St. Udans National Historic Site. One of America's foremost sculptures, Augustus St. Gudans, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, made his summer home here from 1885 to 1897. In addition to the home, gardens, and studio, the park offers two hiking trails that explore the natural areas of 150 acre grounds. We're not going to do any hikes unless it's a short one. I am looking forward to the sculptures though. 
Okay, we're, <laughs> we're actually blocking the main road here. There's only one <laughs> little road. And everyone's going around me. It's up there somewhere and we're on our way up. Okay, this is their handicap parking. How do you know it's handicapped? Because they have a handicap sign over here in the grass. <laughs> kind of odd. They do have RV parking up here also, but I would not recommend taking your rig up. It's a very narrow one lane road and it's quite steep. It's also a grassy area. So I know nothing about this person. That is a beautiful statue of Abraham Lincoln though. I'm glad I sprayed. There's a lot of bugs flying around here. So make sure make sure you have bug spray. Or you sprayed yourself with bug spray. Okay, this is located in the monument in Central Park in New York. Wow! Cool! Diane. This is half size. The other one is in Madison Square Garden in New York. Wow! Wow. The Lincoln Memorial. Wow, he even designed coins. And brilliant, very artistic.
love the customer service in this RV park is phenomenal. Not only do they come after someone pulls out and cleans and sweep and they blow the the leaves and garbage and they pick up garbage here at this park. It's immaculately clean. They also deliver your UPS your Amazon packages to your door. They delivered one for me yesterday when I got back and today I just got back and there is my Amazon package. It's so wonderful. I love this park.